it's Coach Ashling here at Beauty Camp and welcome to today's episode of Beauty TV. So today's episode is all about planking and planking is such a huge part of everyone's workout these days. So the thing about planks is so few people do them properly and actually get the max benefit out of a plank and I know that a lot of you or there's a huge percentage of you out there who feel like you can't do the planks properly or that you feel like you have a lot of pain or a lot of shoulder problems with, with doing these planks. So today's video, I really wanna show you how to get that max benefit out of doing the plank, how to do it properly, even at your, if you're at the lowest level, so you're at the most basic level of a plank and you just can't get the legs up into that position, I'm gonna show you exactly how to work your way up from that level right up to the top level and even if you're at the top level today or you think that you're you know perfect at the plank and you think that you have everything down I'm sure there's going to be a few tips and tricks that you're going to take from this video and use again throughout your planking or in your future workouts so stay tuned on this video I'm going to be working with coach Sean on how to show you how to plank properly and I hope you enjoy the video Okay everyone, so now that we understand the importance of planks from part one in this episode, um, planks are so, so popular now, um, everybody's doing them, and that's why we want to show you how to do them properly here today. From the lowest end, so the most beginner variation, up to the highest end or the hardest variation. So I've brought along Coach Connor here with me today um, to help me show you how to do them properly. So Connor, when you're ready, we're just gonna go through everything if that's okay with you. Mm -hmm. Okay, good stuff. Okay, so before we start, if you want to go now and grab a mat for yourself, you can press pause here, grab your mat and follow along with us. Press play when you come back. It's the only way you're really going to learn and be able to progress onto that highest or the hardest level of the plank, okay? So we're gonna start off now in the beginner variation. So, Connor is in a box position here. So we call the box position when the knee is directly underneath the hip bones and when the hands are directly underneath the shoulders. So what Connor is gonna do here is take his hands a little bit further up past shoulder height or past the shoulder line. And he's gonna drop his hips down, okay? Nice and close towards the mat. So here we have a nice straight line. Hips are in line with the, or sorry, shoulders are in line with the hips and hips are in line with the knees. And in this position, it is extremely important because you're not at the full variation here, that you work very, very hard on contracting that core up to notch number three. So remember we spoke about the belt, so you wanna tighten that belt up to notch number three and hold in this position, okay? So that's pretty tough as it is, Connor, when you hold the contraction, right? Okay, excellent. So now we wanna move on to the next beginner variation of the plank, so that's gonna be coming down onto the elbow. So again, Connor's gonna take his arms a little bit for, um, a little bit more closer towards the top of the mat. That's it. Shoulders again directly in line with the hips, hips in line with the knees. Bring those hips towards the mat and holding that core contraction again. So you want to hold this exactly in that same position as Connor is doing. So hard enough again, Connor, right? Yeah, okay, good stuff. So when I say that these are beginner planks, they're still really, really tough if you do them right. So you're still going to get um, great benefit from doing them. Now we're gonna go to our intermediate plank. So that's up onto the hand plank, and now we're gonna take the feet away from the body rather than moving the arms. So the feet are coming back now. That's it. And you're up onto the hands. Very important that the hands are in line with the shoulders. Again, always remember of that nice straight line. So the shoulders in line with the hips, hips in line with the knees. You're gonna hold that core contraction Tighten up that belly in your mind, okay? Tighten up the belt, that's it. And you're gonna hold that position. And don't forget to breathe, that's it. Okay, take the knees down, lovely. Now we're gonna go into that full variation of the plank. So the top end or the hardest level. So we're gonna take down the elbows, directly underneath the shoulders. So the arms never move forward now. It's always the legs are gonna be moving away from the body to lengthen that lever and make things a little bit more difficult for you. So as you can see here, Connor's shoulders again, directly in line with the hips, very, very important. And Connor, I just want you to show the ladies who are watching there how not to do the plank. So 
This is the first way on how not to do the plank. Connor's bum is right up in the air, the core is disengaged, nothing really happening now in the core. You still might get a little bit of a contraction in there, but you're just kind of wasting your time. You're not getting that max benefit out of the exercise. And this is also quite dangerous to hold your bum down really, really close towards the mat. Okay, you actually have your knees on the mat there, Connor, but if you just hold, there's a big dip here in Connor's back. So that's gonna cause you an injury, gonna cause you back pain and back soreness. So that's definitely a way on how not to do the plank. So now that we've gone through each variation of doing the plank, I wanna give you two bonus moves um, that I really, really find so effective in our booty camp classes that are not only gonna work your core, but that you're gonna get some shoulder action in there some back action and some chest action. So the first move that we want to show you is our plank punches. So we're gonna show it to you in a beginner variation first if you can't quite grasp the full variation. So Connor, if you wanna just come down into that beginner box plank again, and you're just gonna go for your punches. So Connor's just gonna raise an arm up off the mat so you're always testing one side of your core. So you're gonna get some oblique action in here as well with everything else. Always holding that belt at notch number three. I'm gonna keep reminding you guys um, out there to always hold that mild core contraction. Okay, excellent. Now you're just gonna show us the full variation in that one, Connor. So taking the legs back. I think Connor's getting a little bit tired here. <laughs> That's it. And you're gonna give me some punches in that position. So you might want to take the feet a little bit wider on this one because again you've only got one arm to support you so you're going to need a wider base with the legs. So you can take the legs out a little bit wider with this one. Okay Connor, you can rest down there on that one. Okay so that is our plank punches and to show you our very last bonus move it's called our plank suicides. So we're coming down, 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 up and up. Okay so we're going to start off up on the hands. This is our beginner variation. Okay, Connor, if you want to go ahead. Very good move for testing the arms and the shoulders. Super move for testing the core, the obliques, and that whole cylindrical area around the back, front of the tummy. That's it. Excellent. Okay, Connor, if you want to just show us the full variation now. So that was your beginner variation. We're going to take the legs all the way out. That's it, and we're coming down. That's it, and up. So switch the arm every time. Excellent, Connor's not dropping his hips here. He's keeping everything nice and in line. One more, that's it. Excellent job, and you can rest down there, Connor, no problem. You can take it back into a child's pose to stretch out in that position. So this is a great little stretch to do after any plank that you attempt. So I hope you enjoyed that episode today. I hope you can take something from this planking video. There is a lot to be taken from it. So if you need to watch it over again and just pick out whatever you need, then please do so. Uh, thank you for watching again. Okay, everyone. So hopefully you enjoyed today's episode of Beauty TV. But just before you go, I would love to send you on two of my very best workouts. And they are from my 30 day challenge. It's a new challenge that I have created that is running over the course of 30 days. So one of those workouts is gonna be based on one of the Victoria's Secrets angels. And I'm not gonna tell you who she is, it's a big secret. And you can find out if you send me an email to ashling at bootycamp.ie. Now the second workout, if you have any trouble with your muffin top and you're just looking to trim down that area and shape it up, um, again, send me an email to ashling at bootycamp.ie with 30 day challenge in the subject box. My name is also spelled A-I-S-L-I-N-G at bootycamp.ie. So get on it and send me that email and take care and I will see you soon.